At the start, you told this jury that you moved to the other side. Yeah. And you were referring, I think you said, Gyro City and Tukaville? Yeah. Is that STL? Yeah. I mean, it's all the same. I mean, it's different blocks, but it's all the same. It's all the same to me, like, just street names. Don't nobody own nothing. When did you move to STL? Well, I've been over there. I've been going on both sides, period. But I moved over there after I got into it with some guys from Parkway in 2010, the end of 2010. Why did you move over there? A guy named Rara got killed, and I wasn't even out. I wasn't even a part of it, none of that. But, you know, since I didn't want to move, you know, when you probably ain't got nowhere else to go, I was willing to stay up in the parkway, whereas my block had left. Like, all of them who started this sh- and they ran. I stayed there. So eventually they started seeing me coming back and forth, and they had a problem with it. So I just went over there. Did you run into any sort of problems in STL, being that you were a BD? No. Why not? Like I said, the whole low end over there. I never had a problem on those sides that I went on because the low end was over there. If I go somewhere, the low end, like, they they everywhere. The low end everywhere, so I don't be having problems. Again, I just want to make sure I better understand what you mean when you say that the low end is everywhere. What do you mean when you say that? The low end, 22nd and 55th, date to the lake, the project buildings. When they got tore down, they moved south. They moved south. Like most of the buildings moved south, like from the low end to the hundreds. Like most of the people from the project buildings. So based on the geography that you're describing to us, Parkway Gardens, what is STL? Would not be a part of the low end? No. So people from the low end moved south to places like Parkway Gardens and to STL. Yeah, or wherever you can move to, whatever your voucher, Section 8, low income, wherever you can move to. Did you get to know some people over at STL when you moved there? I knew majority of them before I even went over there. I knew majority of them, they moms, because they from low end. Your Honor, can we publish? I'm going to show some exhibits that are admitted. Yes. Showing you what's been admitted in evidence as Government Exhibit 503. Do you know that person depicted in Government Exhibit 503? That's three? What do you mean when you say that's three? That's Doug. What's the reference to three? Best rapper alive, man. He was the best rapper, you know? That was my homie, love brother. Man, like, coolest dude, one of the coolest, smoothest dudes, bro. Like, if a person just got to know him, man, they would know, like, he's just, he's a real person, bro. And that's why I'm here today, for him. How long have you known Duck? I knew Duck damn near all my life, man. We from the same Only thing separate my block and his block is Cottage Grove, man. Like, I know Brick. When me and Brick got close in 06, like, we've been locked in ever since. Objection. Sustained. So let's let's come back to Duck. Let's just have the government ask the next question. Okay. And then try and focus on the question. Okay. Was Duck someone you saw when you moved to STL territory? Yes, sir. Based on what you told us before, it sounds like you said you knew him before you moved to STL? Yes, sir. All right. I'm going to show you another exhibit. May we actually unpublish for a moment, Your Honor? Yes. We can republish, please? Okay. Now, you're seeing what's omitted in evidence as Government Exhibit 558. Do you know the person depicted in Government Exhibit 558? Yes, sir. Who is this? That's Butter. FPG Butter. How do you know this person? I know his whole family. 
We was from the same place on the low end. We from 39th, all of us from 39th. Is this someone you saw when you went over to STL territory? Yeah, that's why I ain't had no problems over there because Butter and them was over there already. A lot of people was over there. Duck and them was over there, Brick and them, Trail. Like everybody was over there. They moms from the low end, so I ain't have no problems. But that's Butter. I'm going to show another already admitted exhibit, Your Honor. Okay. I'm showing what's admitted in evidence as government exhibit 574. Do you know who this person is? I do, in fact, know who this person is. This is Jakira Barnes, known as K.I. How do you know this person? Actually, I was over her when she, when she passed. When she took her last breath, smoke was coming out of her. I was standing over her. Is this someone who lived in STL territory? Yes, sir. Is this someone you got to know when you were living in STL territory? Yeah, she was a kid, but like I ain't hang with, like they ain't hang with me. They was younger. But yeah, you seeing them every day and you talking to them and you know, try to guide them the right way. I'm going to show another already admitted exhibit, Your Honor. Showing you what's admitted as government exhibit 568. Do you recognize the people in this picture? Yeah, that's Butter and K.I. I'm going to show one more already admitted exhibit, Your Honor. Showing you what's admitted as government exhibit 569. Do you recognize the person on the left in this picture? Yes, sir. Who is that? That's a person who I could really call a true friend. Do you know that person's name? Yeah, that's Jermaine Robinson. That's Brick. And is Brick someone you knew before you moved into STL territory? Yep. Is that someone who you saw once you moved over in STL territory? I was with him every day. We was with each other around each other every day, man. Like, that's the that's the smoothest dude, protect the man. Like I love Brick. Objection, judge, sustain. Maybe I'm published for a moment, Your Honor. Yes. I want to fast forward a couple of years, Mr. Wiley, and I want to ask you about August fourth, twenty twenty. At some point, did you learn that Duck had been murdered that day? Yes, sir. And did you do anything in response to learning that Duck had been murdered that day? Yeah, later on, later on, after I felt the taunts and 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 the taunts. So, yeah, I'm sorry, I didn't hear what you said. Later on, after the taunts, like, after they was taunting, you said taunts, T-A-U-N-T-S? Yes. What did you do after hearing or seeing some taunts? I had called in, and they had called me back. When you say you called in, who did you call? To talk to Cav, to talk to Kavna, whatever, whatever you want to say. Did you reach out to law enforcement? Yeah. And without being specific, generally speaking, what was the nature of the reason why you were reaching out to law enforcement. I'm a civilian. I look at myself as a civilian. And I ain't no gang member no more. So, you know, just for Duck, man, like justice for him. It was foul. And I just felt like I had to do what I had to do. Did you indicate that you could provide information to law enforcement? I mean, if they show me, like, if they show me who it was, I can probably nine out of ten times tell you yes. I'm just asking. Yes, sir. What you communicated again, generally speaking, when you reached out and why you reached out? Yes, sir. Was that the purpose of you reaching out? Yes, sir. I want to change gears a little bit, Mr. Wiley, and ask you whether you know some of the current, who some of the current O Block members are. Okay? Okay. Do you... Do you know who some of them are? I mean, depends on who you're talking about. They wasn't there back then. 
Like, I probably ran across them, but I don't know them. Okay, let's... I'm showing you what's admitted in evidence as government exhibit 501, 503, 5051, 5052. Do you recognize the person in those photos that I just showed you? Yeah, that's C. Murder. Your Honor, these are admitted in evidence. I'd ask for permission to publish. Yes. So, 501, 503, 5051, and 5052. You said this is C. Murder? Yeah. How do you know who C. Murder is? That's Sherrod Big Brother, man. Sherrod was like one of the coolest dudes like ever. That shit hurt me too when he got killed because he was like, he was like a pretty boy swag type of guy, you know? Like around the females, got a female and always, always dressed proper, always dressed neat and you know, shit like that, man. You're talking about someone named Sherrod? Yeah, his brother. All right. I'm going to show another exhibit that's already admitted. Showing you what's admitted as government exhibit 562. Do you recognize the person depicted in exhibit 562? Yes, sir. Long live Sherrod, man. He was respectful. The most respectful person out of old block, man. He was the top one. Respectful to everybody. Is Sherrod someone you knew in real life? Yep. Coming back to C-Murder, how long have you known C-Murder or known who he is? Met C-Murder like in 08, 09, some shit like that. He was in jail, just got out of jail, some shit, some stuff. I'm sorry. Do you know who his father is? Yeah, his father right there at Cook County Jail, commissary. Have you ever seen C-Murder inside of Parkway Gardens? Yeah. How many times? A few times I've seen him. Yeah, a few times. And I apologize if you said this. Do you know C. Murder's real name? Charles. Do you know his last name? Yeah, Liggins. Is Charles Liggins or C. Murder someone you see here in the courtroom today? Shit, they all look different now. I mean, oh, he back there behind, behind the guy back there. Would you mind describing? So you've pointed to the back there, just describing an article of clothing that he's wearing. By the TV, right by the TV. What color shirt is he wearing? A white shirt. You said by the TV? Yeah. So in the corner of the room? Yeah. Okay, let the record reflect that Mr. Wiley has identified. Sorry, objection. Can we have a sidebar? Yeah. Mr. Wiley, I'm going to show you two pictures that have already been admitted in evidence. Government Exhibit 507 and Government Exhibit 509. Do you recognize the person depicted in Government Exhibit 507 and 509? That's Kenny Mack. How do you know that's Kenny Mack? He was in jail with me. He was my celly. How long have you known Kenny Mack? Since 2014. How long were the two of you cellmates? For months, like two, three months. We in here for months. That's all I'm going to say. It's been a long time. I've done had my cellies. And during that period of time, would you see each other every day? Yeah, yes. Do you know his real name? Kenneth Robertson. With respect to Mr. Robertson, when you met him or became associated with him in 2014, was he living in Parkway Gardens at that time? No, he's not from Parkway. Do you see Mr. Robertson in the courtroom today? Front row, white shirt. And generally speaking, where on the side closest to this wall right here or the side closest to the door in the middle? The record will reflect that the witness has identified defendant Kenneth Robertson. I'm going to show you a couple of more pictures that have been admitted into evidence. I'm showing you what's admitted as Government Exhibit 512, 514, 
15 1, 15 2, and 15 3. Do you recognize the person depicted in government exhibits 512, 514, and 515 1 through 3? Yes. Who do you recognize that person to be? That's Los. Do you know Los' real name? To Carlos. How long have you known who Los is or known Los? I've known Los since I've been in Parkway, since I moved in there. Like Los, T. Roy, I knew all of them. Them, the first people I probably met was them. So it's someone you've seen in Parkway Gardens before? Yeah. You ever had a conversation before with? Yeah, many of them. He's only... Just go ahead. Do you remember whether you spoke to Carlos or Los on or August 4th, 2020? Yes, before it. Yes, yep. Under what circumstances? Just what's up, like, on a phone. And was this like a voice call? Yeah, FaceTime. You saw his face on August 4th. Yeah, it was FaceTime. Did you call him or were you talking to somebody, talking to somebody else and he came past? That's what's the name? He came past what? Came past the screen. You know how you ain't been somewhere in a long time. You see somebody, you be like, oh man, that's Lowe's. Put him on the phone, you know, shit like that. Something like that. Do you see to Carlos or Lowe's sitting in the courtroom? Lowe's is in the back. He's in the back, way in the back. Could you describe something that he's wearing? He has his hair in a bun. He got his hair wrapped up on top. What color shirt is he wearing? Look like a gray and black one. The record will reflect that the witness has identified to Carlos Ofert. Your Honor, right now I'm about to get into the thing we talked about. Okay, we're going to take a lunch break at this point. We'll come back at in about an hour. So that will be around 1.20. Excuse me, Your Honor. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. Can they sidebar with some heat? Because I'm catching spasms up here. Sorry, but the air is nifty. I'll look into that. At this point, let's proceed with the questioning. Okay, I was just asking. And I'll check. Mr. Wiley, I'm going to show you a couple of more pictures, and these four have also been admitted into evidence. May I publish, Your Honor, or maybe publish? Yes. I'm showing you what's been admitted as Government Exhibit 526, 5281, 5282, and 5283. Coming back to Government Exhibit 526, do you recognize the person or persons depicted in Government Exhibit 526? 281, 282, 5282, and 5283. That's Muwap. How do you know who Muwap is? I know of him. I don't know him. Like, I know of him. I seen, seen him. I don't know him. I don't know him. You don't have a personal relationship with him? Yeah, I don't have a personal relationship. Have you ever seen him in person? Yeah. When was the last time you think you saw him? Years. Like, he probably was a kid. Like, he probably was younger than what he is now. He was way younger than what he is now. Where was the last time you saw him? Probably 63rd. Like, marching up 63rd or, you know, just being like a kid. Like, with the rest out, what they do, interact with each other. Would you mind turning the mic again closer to you? Yeah. You said marching down 63rd? Yeah, like marching down 63rd. You know how people be deep, how they little crowds? Well, you don't know how they be, but they, you know, you get deep with your homies and then you just march like you march. Objection to the narrative and volunteered information. So why don't you ask the next question? Do you see the person you, by the way, do you know his real name? Marcus, I think. Yeah. Do you see the person you know as Marcus or Muwap here in the courtroom? You know what? I don't see him. I don't see him. Don't see him? Okay. Maybe unpublish? Yes. 
I'm going to show you now what's been admitted into evidence as Government Exhibit 2000. May we republish, Your Honor? Yes. And I'm going to play this. I'm going to play the entire thing, but I'm going to play portions of it, and I'll pause it at the times I may ask you some questions. Okay? Yep. Can you tell the jury what are you looking at where I have Government Exhibit 2000 pours? Generally speaking, you're looking at inside of Parkway, old block, it's on the back. It's the, I mean, it's like what you call the first lot, second lot, or third lot. It's by lot. Okay. You say it's by lots? They call it by lots. You label it by lots. First lot, second lot, third lot. And this is Parkway Gardens? Yeah. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000 from the 20th, 2nd mark. Do you see anyone you recognize on the screen at this part of Government Exhibit 2000? That's the Carlos. You said what now? That's Los. Where do you see Los on the screen? By the black car. Got out of the black car. So this screen in front of you is a touch screen? Do me a favor. Can you take your finger and just mark on the screen somehow where you see, okay, you've just drawn a circle in yellow at the bottom right portion of the screen? Yep. That's Lowe's? Yep. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. Do you recognize anyone on the screen right now at the 2 minute 49 second mark? Yes. Who is that? You just drew a circle in yellow on the left side of the screen. That's Muwap. Your Honor, could we go to a sidebar, please? Yes. Mr. Wiley. Yes, sir. Did you just identify Muwap? Yes, sir. In the 2 minute 49 second mark? Yes, sir. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. You recognize someone on the screen right now? Yeah. Who? That's Kenny Mack. I'm sorry, I'm doing it. Would you mind? Real close. Indicating on the screen where you see Kenny Mack. Yes. You just drawn a circle in yellow and approximately the center of the screen. Yeah. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. You recognize someone on the screen right now? That's C. Murder. Would you mind indicating on the screen where it is you see C murder? You've just drawn a circle in yellow in the middle of the screen. Yes. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. I just paused Government Exhibit 2000 at the 34 minute 36 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right now? Yep. Who? That's Muwap. And you've just drawn a circle in the middle of the screen in yellow? Yep. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. Do you recognize the person on... I've paused Government Exhibit 2000 at the 4 minute 36 second mark. Do you recognize the person on the left side of the screen? On the left side? Yeah, that's Kenny Mack. And you've just drawn a circle on the left in yellow. Yep. Alright. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. Do you recognize... I paused at the 4 minute 40 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right now? Yep, that's the murder. You've drawn, you've just drawn a circle on the left in yellow. Yep. I resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. And I've paused at the 4 minute 46 second mark. I'm actually going to fast forward. So I fast forward to 12 minutes 3 second mark. I'm going to resume playing from here. I've paused Government Exhibit 2000 at the 12 minute 25 second mark. Do you recognize the person who exited the driver's side of a yes? Where you started, you've drawn a circle on the screen in yellow. Who is that? Kenny Mack. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. I've paused Government Exhibit 2000 at the 12 minute 59 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the left side of the screen? In the front, that's Kenny Mack. 
You've drawn a circle on the left in yellow. Yes. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. I've paused Government Exhibit 2000 at the 13 minute, 10 second mark. Can you tell the jury generally what this is that we're looking at on the screen? They just came out the first lot. What would be the first lot they just came out of? And they coming around past the 58th and 56th building of Parkway, 58, 6358, and 6356. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000 from here. Do you recognize someone? I've paused at Government Exhibit 2000 at the 13 minute, 30 second mark. Do you recognize someone in approximately the center of the screen? Yes. Who is that? That's Kenny Mack. And you've just drawn a circle in the center of the screen? Yes. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000 from here. Pause Government Exhibit 2000 at the 14 minute, 50 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right here? Yup. Who is that? That's C. Murda. And you've just drawn a circle on the middle of the screen. Yup. I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. Pause Government Exhibit 2000 at the 15 minute, 17 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right now? Yup. And who's that? That's Kenny Mack. And you just drew a circle in yellow in the middle. Yes. I'm going to resume playing. Pause that 16 minute, nine second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right now? That's Kenny Mack. And you've just drawn a circle on the left in yellow. Yup. All right, I'm going to resume playing Government Exhibit 2000. Pause Government Exhibit 2000 at the 17 minute, two second mark. Do you recognize someone who just went in the right side of a gray car? Yes, sir. Who's that? Kenny Mack. And you just drew a circle on the screen in yellow? Yup. In the middle? Yup. And I'm going to resume playing Pause Government Exhibit 2000 at the 17 minute, 10 second mark. Do you recognize someone on the screen right now? Yeah. Who is that? That's Kenny Mack. Would you mark on the screen where you see Kenny Mack? Have you drawn two circles on the screen in yellow? It's double. It's zoomed in? Yeah, it's two people. So I figure circle both of them. May I have one moment, Your Honor? Yes. Nothing further, Your Honor.